Meantime, meteorologist Kate Westerholm spoke to state and local officials to find out how they're preparing for the storm. Kate? Yeah, Jen, so far this winter season, we really haven't seen much snow, but in just a few days, we have the potential to see our first significant snowfall of this season. As confidence increases in the forecast, the Cambria County Emergency Management Agency says that they are prepared for what's to come. Right now, we're just kind of watching the weather reports and consulting with our, our folks at Pennsylvania Emergency Management and our um, weather staff in Harrisburg. Still a little early to know exactly what's going to happen when, but they're all on standby and at the ready. We're just kind of watching. As confidence increases in the forecast, local and state officials have began planning how to keep roads clear once the snow starts falling. Tomorrow we will have um, a statewide WebEx and that's, you know, everybody involved across the state that will just have a conversation for situational awareness. Locally in Cambria County, preparations have already begun as well. Uh, yeah, we've obviously been in contact um, with Pima and the National Weather Service. We like to uh, you know, keep abreast of, of those um, events before they happen, if we can. And internally, you know, we have our staff prepared. If we need to gear up with extra personnel, we'll do that. We make sure that all of our portable equipment is in operating order and functioning. You, know, you don't want to wait till the middle of a storm to make sure that it works and uh, you know, get out there in front of it. PennDOT and the Cambria County EMA also said that they both have plenty of staff available to cover and take extra shifts despite COVID cases being so high. Right now, we're very good. We're fortunate to have um, great staffing. Equipment's ready if anything should come up, you know, as far as call offs or anything like that, we can adjust routes and schedules needed to cover the storm. We do have some cases of COVID, but our, our staffing is adequate. And you know, we do have contingency plans. If we need to bring uh, people in extra shifts, we can do that. Even though we see snow often in Pennsylvania, it's still important to remind drivers of how to stay safe when road conditions deteriorate. If it's absolutely necessary for folks to get out you know, during this bad weather, we encourage them to give themselves extra time to where they need to go because uh, conditions will be bad. Uh, we make sure and reinforce that everybody, you know, takes precautions, has layered clothing, you know, in the eventuality they, they would get stuck. Uh, we also want to, you know, recommend that they have a great situational awareness. You know, it's not absolutely necessary for them to go out. Uh, we do encourage them to stay in. Uh, but if they do go out and obviously have communications available with their cell phones, make sure they're fully charged. And if they need to call for assistance, they can do that. Be careful around our plow equipment. Don't try to pass them. And if you want to know anything about current weather conditions, go to 511pa.com. Be sure to stay up to date with the latest weather forecasts as we get closer to this weekend. And remember that if you don't absolutely have to be out in the snow, stay at home. Reporting in Johnstown, Kate Westerholm, 6 News.